Hello everybody, welcome to PowerPoint Academy channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how to design a professional slide contains this flashlight animation to show a title or whatever you want. And I will teach you how to create and use buttons to do such animation. As you see, by clicking on, it lights and go away on clicking off. You can use this design as an intro to your video if you are interested in making videos or as an introduction to your presentation to get the attention of the people to the title you will talk about. But before starting, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel to be able to see our free upcoming tutorials. Let's go! Okay, firstly, I will create a blank layout by right click on the slide and layout then choose blank. Then I will add the word which is PowerPoint Academy, the name of our channel. PowerPoint Academy and cancel. And I will make some changes in the font size and font type. Here you need a large bold color as possible as you can. I prefer this one. Okay, make it more large in size and bring it to the center of your slide. Then add a square fit to your slide format and remove the outline. And now I will bring it to the back or send it to the back. Then select the word and the square and go to format then merge shapes in merge shapes you should choose combine so the word will be combined in the shape of the square as you see there is no word you have only a square with openings fit to the word powerpoint academy ok control m to create a new slide to prepare our flashlight picture i will bring it here, control C, then control V to paste it. Okay, I will do some changes in this picture by cropping it to this light only. I only need this light with the rays. Okay, like this and click on crib okay i will make it in a certain shape like this then control c and control v then put it in outside the uh, your outside your slide like this okay I will choose dark color for the square and background. Please note that the color background will be the color of your word. As I have told you that the, uh, there is no word literally, but there is spaces or openings in the shape, as you see, which make a shape of the word. So. If you choose any uh, color of the background, it will be the color of these letters, like this. But I will choose a dark color, particularly the same color in the background of our flashlight picture. Then I will choose a degree of color near to this for the shape, like this. Then more colors and make it more lighter like this okay as you see if i oh sorry i will send it to the back if i will move this flashlight it will appear like this and then i need to make it do this motion or movement automatically then go to animations add animation and choose custom pose okay make your custom pose like this adjust it carefully then 
due to outside uh, slide. Okay, if you uh, reach the end of the custom bus, please double click on the left double click, I mean, then animation pane and do the changes or modification in the custom bus effect. Okay, bring smooth end to zero and smooth start to zero. And now make it after previous seven seconds and make it repeat until end of the slide. It will be in this manner. Okay, and now let's preview this slide. Okay, very nice. Okay, and as you see, it is repeated until I end this slide. Okay, Control D to duplicate the slide, and I will make another animation. You can use it as an alternative to this one. Very quickly, I will choose the lines and make it from right to left, like this. Then I will move it to this part. Okay, bring it to zero. Smooth start to zero, seven seconds. And make it until end of the slide and after previous. And press OK. OK, I need it to five. To be more faster. And let's preview it you will have the light motion like this and it will, will be repeated as you see okay second part in this tutorial is to make buttons and how to use these buttons okay i remove this one no i will work on the same slide okay the idea of using button is that if the, I will make an um, on button and off one, if I click on the on button, the, this picture will appear here and the uh, words will be lighted and it will go away if I press on the off button. Let's see how to make this. Firstly, I will remove all the animation here and I will make a large picture of the light like this just to make it light ok control M to prepare our buttons and let's bring this picture control C and here control V ok here I will make a group in the picture to use this color as this button and this one so I will make two copies by pressing control V of this picture and now let's crop this to be on and Group the other one to be the off button. Okay, and now I will remove the background of this uh, button. As we learned it in the previous tutorials, double click on it and choose remove background. All the background will be removed. Click on keep changes and you will have uh, on put. I will do the same for this one. Remove background. Also the background will be removed, keep changes and it will be removed. Okay. Select all of them, control C and then control V. Make them more small like this. Press one in this area and the other in this area. Okay. The trick here is in the animation of this picture, not these. But firstly uh, I want to teach you something very important if you want to use the animation of buttons you should know the name of this button in uh, the powerpoint and the name of this, this button in the powerpoint uh, okay i will tell you what i mean if you go format selection pane okay now this button is known in the powerpoint by picture 7 and this one is known by picture 8. I don't want that. I want to make this button, uh, to make the name of this button on and this one is off. 
you can do this by click on the button selection selection pen and click here and write whatever you want I will name it by on and this one this one I will name it off and press enter okay and after few seconds you will know the importance of this step now I will go to animation of this shape not of these buttons okay I will make an entrance animation by wipe no I will choose I will choose fade to appear in this manner and then make it to uh, two seconds like this okay very good now double click on it timing and use trigger okay here this uh, uh, you will see start effect on click off choose it or check on it and you will have all the objects elements in this slide so now you see the importance of the previous step of naming the object because you will find on and click ok so now the powerpoint knows that if you click on this shape which is named in the powerpoint by on this animation will be happy ok let's make the other one for the off button I will use feed bar but exit feed like this make it 1.5 second again double click timing triggers and the check start effect and easily you will find off okay and now let's preview our project okay if you click on this button the shape will appear and the word will be light if you click on it again it will be appear again and now if you click on off button there is no light again on and off and now we reach the end of our tutorial if you like this video please like it and subscribe to our channel to see our upcoming free videos and if you have any comment or any question please write it in the comment section thank you